Welcome to Bruce's Eclectic World. And in today's video, <laughs> we're already done the un uh, entry and unboxing of this kit. Uh, 71 dusters, 340. And this is for uh, Grandpa Mark's Hobbies Facebook Mopar Group Build, which started August the 1st. There's no ending date. But today is September 1st, so I'm only 31 days behind already. Good job, Bruce. So before I forget, we're going to write on here starting September 1st, 24. Okay, I do that on all my kids so that way when I get done. I know... How long it took. <laughs> and this is, according to this note, update number one. Yay! Uh, which means we're going to open it up and start on it. <laughs> so, this is a eBay. No, wait a minute. Let me, let me think about this a minute. No, this is a... Purchase off of uh, Mr. Mini Mike over to Mini's Model Auctions on Facebook. There'll be a link in the description below and right here. And uh, these, this is a used kit, so we looked at it in the unboxing, and it's all here. So what we're going to do tonight, while we may, here we got some flashy stuff to clean up. While we're chitter chatting with our buddies, because we're supposed to have a uh, a group live tonight, we'll be working on this, getting it sorted out, and getting things done, and we have decals, so we'll see where that takes us. We'll put them in there just like that because from now on, this box will sit just like this over there. Over there. You can't see, but if you look at my little picture, you can see me pointing right back there. <laughs> Until it's done. And it will get... Mr. Pink Towel on top of it. It's kind of washed out on the camera, ain't it? Anyway. I cover them up so they don't get all dirty. So. We're getting ready to join the live here in just a little bit. So I might just as well. Get, get this stuff out of the box. Oh, yeah, Mini Mike's Auctions is uh, also Scale Model Outlaw. Go over to his channel. We also have started a uh, live chat where we have a guest every week or every other week or something. Anyway, with Mike and Jason over to... KRD, you would think I would know my buddy's name of his channel, <laughs> Cars and Designs or something like that. I'll put it right here because I'm old and I can't remember shit. Anyway, uh, that's on Thursday nights at 8 p.m. over on, uh, right now it's on Scale Model Outlaws channel. So go over there and... Uh, Jump into that live and chat down in the chat and we'll be having tips and tricks and special guests and all kinds of awesome stuff. We plan it one week in advance. <laughs> I happen to be the uh, making a mess. 
the producer, which means I'm the chief cook, bottle washer, water boy. And that's okay. And we're gonna find some different wheels because we're not using these wheels. These are 14 inch wheels. Oh, they're nice wheels. I don't know, we'll see. But that goes over there on top of all that stuff. I got Mr. Mars I need to work on yet. That'll be tomorrow. If you're wondering what this mess is, this is for my uh, under 1,000 group build. I got to do wood grain. That's what all this paint's for. So it'll be interesting to see how that works out. I did it last year on the USEC group build. And uh, we'll be doing uh, wood grain again on this one. On this pickup truck. This time I won't try to remember to film it. I forgot to film it the other one. <laughs> Cause I was just going, I was just trying it out to see how it was going to go, go, and I got excited and forgot to hit the record button. Oopsie. Anyway, uh, being it today, September the first, the USAC group build announcement came out today. Also, and our buddy over in Sweden, Kim at Kim Customs, is that it? Uh, picked the 68 Hemi Dart for the USAC group build, which starts September 14th and goes to, uh, hmm, March 16th, I believe. Might be wrong, but I'll put the date right here. Anyhow, so if you're a content creator, Go over to Facebook, to the USAC uh, Facebook page, and join the USAC Facebook, and grab you a 68 Dart, which is probably going to be $79 on eBay every time you see this video. <laughs> Scalpers. And uh, <clears throat> get started, which, which means I'm building this Mopar. And that Mopar, and I have another Mopar I'm, I'm going to be building. We're just up to our eyeballs and Mopars. So, <laughs> there's the buy D. You know what I've not seen? I'm not seeing the bucket. I thought the bucket was in here. Wait a minute. The bucket is part of the chassis on this one. I forgot. A chink. Yep. Show sure enough is. There's the floorboard. Nothing wrong with that. So you guys go there. So we might as well get Mr. Snippers out here. And we'll cut number 79 off right right there because it's got a it's got a nice little handle. So we can paint this with. That's why I, I try to leave that on there so we can paint. I take black paint and go along the back back edge here. And you, you don't know that you won't know the difference. And uh, see, this is all suspension parts. We're going to hang on to that for a minute. And there's some more suspension parts. We're going to hang on to that for a minute. And I'm looking, 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 looking. Okay, that's engine interior parts. Okay. We only have one engine option. And what is the engine option in this? Well, it's a 340, Bruce. Duh. 
I'm pretty sure it's all. Sure, that game has options. Let's see. <laughs> I guess I should take a nap before going to bed. Well, it looks like we have a choice of a six pack or single carburetor, and guess what we're going to do? We're right down to six pack. Yay! What in the world is 64? E64. Does this have a. Eh, yeah, of course it doesn't. Hmm. Well, guess we'll figure that out when we find it. I like that exhaust system's in three pieces. So, we'll get out our little plastic bags. Here, hold that, Mr. Mike. Oop. As we use our little bags. I can't reach them because I moved them. Ugh! I'm taking stuff off of trees. I like to separate them so I know what part goes where. So this is got interior and body parts. So uh, okay, that's interior. Go with that. This is chassis. Eat huh. Ertel flag. This is chassis parts. So we'll put that like that, like that right now. Or is it body? Well, body parts, chassis parts. What, what's one of those two? And this is off C. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. I know what this is. And I know what it's going to be done. going with that part. This is engine part, so this goes with the engine bag. Engine bag can go right there for now. That goes to the interior, there's engine, interior, interior, chassis, and yeah, it has a, it has a bunch of flash right there, but it's not on the parts. So this is chassis parts, which goes there for now.
I like it when the handles are provided. Let's see, what is that? That is a battery. So that goes over here with this stuff. And these are hoods, the hood scoops. So that's by the by the junk plastic. Okay, so this is chassis. So is this. And we'll cut this off there and cut it right there. And then we'll deal with that part in a minute. Most likely. Let's see. Exhaust. Jesse. Spoiler is part of the body. Uh. Make sure you're this part we're not using. Okay, so that's steering column. Not sure. It has a number on it, so we're going to leave that number. Ports and guessing that's the hose of some sort. I don't know. We'll find out because we'll save the tag with it. Where is my plastic box? There it is. I need a bigger plastic box because that looks cool. Kit number. I had several people ask about Ugg. He's on a sabbatical. He's doing a extreme makeover. Uh, let me put it this way. Uh, Grisha Formula 44. Does that ring about anybody? Yeah, he's, he's trying to grow hair because everybody was upset because he didn't have any hair. And, yeah. Uh, we got a tailor trying to make some clothes for him. Not going good. No. No. But. 
we're, we're, we're uh, pretty sure that we're going to keep plugging away and persistence is going to take over and he's going to prevail and everything's going to be okie dokie and people won't be asking what is that scary thing over there they're going to be going who is that handsome guy you see that guy on tv you know on the commercials insurance commercials well not anymore because that was too rude. That was uncouth. People, I swear. Anyway, he's going to be absolutely awesome when he gets back, I'm told. I don't know. I'm just going by what Callie said. You know how cows are. <laughs> they just move right along. <laughs> Get it? Move right along. Okay, that, those are engine parts. We'll trade them, put them over there with the... And this is chassis parts. I'm not... We're not going to be using these wheels. So that can go in the box. Nice. We'll just leave them right on there. And what are you? You are what? You are a mysterious part because you have no number. Maybe that's your number. What is your number? Your number is. 53, so would that be that part? 53. Let's see what 53 is. Fifty-three, fifty-three. Hello, 53. Looking for a picture. It looks like 53. There's a 32, 33. Fifty-three. Hello, fifty-three. I'm not seeing a fifty-three. Okay, well. It's a mystery. It's a mystery guest. That's what it is. There it is. Must be steering shaft. Because it goes there. It looks like it points up towards the dash. So we're going to call it steering shaft. There we go. Awesome sauce. Get back over and behave. Printing part, printing part, printing part. Okay, we'll cut that off there for now. I don't know why I saved those. It's the Bruce in me, just can't get rid of stuff. Okay, this is cut down. 
This is the process I go through every time I build a model. I separate all the parts. I put them in the bag, and that bag is not going to be bigger enough. I have a bag bigger enough. And it happens to be a Steve McQueen. Because Rex just cannot do the job. Rex, you can't get it done, man. It's all right, buddy. We have another job for you. Trust me. It's all good. So we put that in there and 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 that in there. And, and, Bueller, Bueller, Bueller. Sorry. <laughs> okay, and that's those parts. Now where'd it go? I have hardwood floors you would think you would not lose anything on a hardwood floor. But I'm going to tell you something. There's a wormhole underneath here somewhere. If I drop stuff on this hardwood floor, it just disappears. I don't understand it. My, my buddy Kyle over to... RKD Skill Works, he says that uh, there's a wormhole that sends everything to Deep Space Nine. If that be the case, I'm sure Kira and, and Dex and all that are having having a blast keeping track of all that stuff floating around that space station. So, I'm going to probably want to keep that too. But it goes in this bag. Okay, so there is the beginning. Need a bigger work area besides this spot right here. And yeah, this is all the engine parts. Except for that. And... I'm sure that's a body part of some sort. We'll figure it out in a bit when we start breaking that tree down. So here you go, folks. This is going to be my 71 duster build. There it is. Too bad I can't go poof and it's done. Maybe I could do that at the very ending. Go poof and it's done. <laughs> Yeah, well, good luck with that thinking, Bruce. So, stay tuned for the uh, next segment of this update one. We'll get everything together and kind of maybe muck some stuff up. And then we'll be on to update number two. See you in the next segment. Bye. Greetings. Welcome back to this segment. Of the Grandpa Mark's Hobbies Facebook group build that has now turned into a buddy build of sorts. So I was uh, talking with my good friend Mark or Grandpa Mark's Hobbies and was teasing him about I'm going to send me send him a motor or excuse me engine to build for me. Gussy it all up with all the wires and plug wires and little springs and fuel lines and all that fancy stuff that I can no longer do. And he said he would do it. So, 
in this little box <laughs> not so little there's other stuff in the box in this box is the engine for this this uh, dart that we're going to build 71 dart bought off a of mini's model auction and uh, we got her mocked up there I'm hanging on to the wheels because they they'll, they'll fall off but the interior fits the hood fits we decided to go with the uh, scoops on there my buddy said it would look better so I agreed front end fits the bumpers fit the uh, Chassis all together fits, kinda. Yeah, the wheels are falling off. I saw I said it's falling up. It's held together, tic tac. So we got uh, got that all ready to go. We have uh, the spoiler just fell back off, but it's 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 glued together, and ready to go back on. We'll just throw it in the back of the car there. There we go. We have the uh, these are the wheels. We're going to go ahead and use the standard wheels that come with it. They're nice and crisp and everything. So we're going to put a little quick shot of some smoke on there and dull them down just a tad. Uh, <clears throat> we've got the bucket seats ready to go. Of course, we've got the, the grill support ready to go. We got the steering wheel, steering shaft together. Yay! And then we got the wire brake booster. No, brake master cylinder. Blah. There's no booster on this, Bruce. And the window washer and the blower motor on there. That's ready to go. The exhaust system's in the bag, ready to be painted. Everything's test fitted, and it all works. We'll be using... Createx. I seem to use that a lot, don't I? Uh, this is a pearl tangerine. I'm not, it doesn't look quite right on the camera, does it? Eh, that's alright. And then uh, we're going to have a white interior. Just simple colors. Uh, there'll be, we'll probably put some, you know, there'll be black and chrome silver and, you know, all that other stuff that goes along with building these things. So, I told Mark not to hurry. <laughs> no big rush, but he said as soon as he gets it, he's going to start working on it. I said, well, make a video. So, I don't know where he is or not, but you'll have to go over to his channel. We'll put it right here. There's the link. It'll also be in the description below. Uh, go over and see his channel. Give a like and subscribe to the share over there. Uh, oh, wait a minute. You did here, too. You know, I want to like and subscribe and share. So, come on over. If you hear some other noise back there, that's my buddy, Dart. <laughs> We're on a chat, too. <laughs> Wait a minute, we turn the mic around here. Say something. Hey, welcome to the Dart Kids. Oh, wait, wrong channel. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyhow, thank you for watching. This is update number one, over and out. We'll, uh... Catch you in the update number two. Primer and painting and things like that. So you be kind to your neighbors. You don't know when you'll see them again. Save the fingers. And we want to thank all of our service people out there that gave their lives for this awesome country. And for the ones that serve us now and protect us. And keep us safe so we can build model cars. I have neighbors that are service people. I'm sure you do too. Be sure to thank them. They gave for this country and they need to be thanked. So take care, my friends. We'll see you in the next video. And see you later. Bye bye. Bye bye. Go on. Shoot now. Go watch somebody else. <laughs> bye. Click.